What's up, and people? Today we are here with Pokemon uh, Uriam, and we're going to be continuing on Punzel. So I'm not sure what I was doing from. Oh wait, no, I do remember. So uh, we were in this power plant trying to find a power cell. So let's go in here. Uh What the Was the Pokemon just running towards me right there? That's that looked dangerous. Um Jeez, there's like so many swarms of Pokemon at me, like Jesus, what? 75? You got out of your mind, bro. I should have actually switched out, but whatever. Yeah, let me switch out now. <laughs> you probably go for like Sludge Bomb or some shit. Psychic. That's not stab. Yeah, you can't really touch me, even though you're level 75, which is like crap tons of levels higher than me. Another one. Are they all level 75? Yep. There's no match for my melee, so. Yeah, that one. <laughs> he went straight for a sludge bomb. Let me go ahead and go for a home claws. I don't want to miss and I want to kill one in one hit. You can't poison me. This will hurt, sir. No, no, I'm not gonna do shit. I got my attack up, my bad. I'm, I'm betting there's an extra one. Uh, let me go ahead and heal up. It's good they can have a lot of antidotes. I wish I could put on max repel. This is getting annoying. <laughs> are so high level compared to me, like, Jesus. I feel like I'm on the right track because all these high level monsters, uh, I mean Pokemon. I should be on the right track. Ow. Oh, man, I can one-shot with just... A simple mirror match? Let's see. Lower my special defense. No, I cannot. I can't one shot. You're a wild Pokemon. Why are you spamming the same move? Have they gained sentience? Even though that Pokemon is so high level, it's not giving me too much XP. 
That's why I probably think what's the problem here. My Pokemon just don't get XP from this game. As I'm, <laughs> so it's causing me to face higher level mo uh, Pokemon. I keep, I keep trying to say monsters. Why? They're not monsters. They have a categorized name. They're Pokemon. Anyways. Okay, sorry, something was on my, uh, I was getting notifications. I'm a little lost. Um, oh, this is where I came from. I would like to grind out on these, these Pokemon, but even though they're the same level as me, they're not giving me anything. I hate that. I can't really see to make out my surroundings on knowing where I'm going. Everything is just a narrow space. And with these wild Pokemon. <coughs> no, with these wild Pokemon, it makes it hard to know that. Uh, it makes it hard for me to remember what track I was just on. Holy gross. Yeah, I can burn you. Amazing. Slime covering its body is toxic and corrosive. Between that and its electric bites, it has no known predators. <laughs> they uh, proliferate in contaminated areas. They proliferate in, in contaminated areas. Oh boy. That bone sounds immensely dangerous. It has no known predators. I'm guessing that because it has no predators because honestly anything that tries to even compete against this thing is most likely going to end itself, uh, end up killing itself, most likely. Burn heal. Don't tell me this is where I came from. Yep. It's hard to make out where I'm going with this damn Pokemon encountering me every five seconds. Ugh. If I could just make it out with a clear mind and clear footing on where I'm going. Oh, thank God. You can't stop nuclear Pokemon from, uh, Cancering you because of the mechanic for them. So every five seconds I make a step, this is gonna keep happening. They can even put a function or something in the game that can prevent you from encountering them. Come on, bro. I think I saw that switch before I even came into this building. I mean, right when I came into this building. I just didn't feel like touching because I thought you would have to interact with something else to get to it. Uh, 
Is this just a circle? No, there's something up here. A power cell. Click. The power cell fits right into the hazard suit. Power cell accepted. Perform performing sync status check complete. Rebooting calm. Reboot failed. Unknown frequency is jamming signal. Rebooting navigate. Reboot success. Each sector performing scan for curing. Scan complete. Estimated location, north sector. Additional protocols now available. Strength protocol. Mission objectives subdue and eliminate security. Deviating from mission protocols is unadvised. I believe, I believe that's what it said. So I can go back to the previous area I was just in and see what items I could get thanks to this parasol being back. And after that, I can, um... We can go head to north sector of here that's face cure. So I believe that's what I'm going to do. If I could just stop encountering Pokemon. Holy moly moly. What if I try flipping that switch again? Nah. Please let me get the hell up out of here. At least calm down the, 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 the rate where Pokemon encounter you, because Jesus, this is so much. Leave me alone. Flash can, not bad. Let me give that to you, my dude. Oops. I am... Um, oh, you can't do it like that. Okay. Where are you? Flash cannon. Where are you? There we go. That's a bomb right here. Damn it. Flash scan, psychic, focus blast. The only move I need now is um, Calm Mind. I want Calm Mind, but I can't put it on to you because effing. Uh, may I give you Rabbit Spin? I don't know. Rabbit Spin is good in some cases, in case uh, I'm up against some Dilwee who, think, who thinks he's competitive at this game. <laughs> who knows? Can I surf in that water? No, I can't. It makes sense. Gagarich. Let me try uh, catching you. That's right, you're immune to nuclear. Can you live this in power, please? No. Those give you a lot of XP though. I like that. Oh, lordy. Already caught you, sir. Um okay. The Megastone. Arbogite. Alright. Luckily, I already made a tutorial on this game about Megastone, so... I can go ahead and get that for free. Fuck. I'm so done with this, bro. So, if I push this here... Uh, okay, I think this may work.
No, it didn't work. <laughs> I thought it would. I really didn't look it through it because I just wanted to get this shit over with. But okay, I see how it works. Let's escape. Let's come back in. Uh, so I can't do it like that. Then how can I do it? Let's try it like this. Fuck. Okay. This almost looks impossible, but... I think it should work. Uh, if I try and attempt every strategy left, then I, then I guess we'll give up. Okay, so I have one more strategy left with this, and it should work. Shit. If it weren't for these wild Pokemon, I would just be adamant about doing this, but... Ugh. Ah. If I push this all the way, it's gonna happen. Oh, I see. Okay, I know how to do it now. So all the power's back on. This my effing wild Pokemon, bro. This shit is annoying. They actually thought there was a good thing. Bruh. We practically did nothing. <laughs> it's only it's almost been half an hour. I mean it's been almost twenty minutes. All because these wild Pokemon encounter me every five seconds. Hope all you burn the hail. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this. I think I screw that. Let's see here. Yeah. I'm so done with the nuclear Pokemon, bro. Uh huh. So I could probably move him like that. Mm -hmm. 
I'm trying to think here, come on. Read my thought process. Luckily, I made it. I actually had to sit down and think. His. Click the door and unlocked it. Intense radiation levels. Estimated shield duration 5 minutes. The caution is recommended. Beyond this point, there can be no coming back. Yep. Location North Sector. Estimated shield duration 5 minutes. Oh shit. Okay, our Pokemon is somewhat healed. We're good. Trying to go inside here for under five minutes is very dangerous. The timer is still up even after a Pokemon battle? Yeah. If I could just move my Wheelodink, just a few milli inches before I can figure out where I am and going. That'd be great. I'm not sure if I have five minutes to really explore this place. Okay, dead end. Okay, it's been almost a minute. Is that like all radiation inside that pools or whatever? That green stuff, is that actually radiation fluid? Is that nuclear waste? Are you kidding me? I gotta tell you, I shaved and I feel like shit. Dead end. There's a lot of radiation inside this building. Alright, it's been two minutes. You have three minutes left. Oops, I didn't even see that. Paraboom. Ugh. You know, how growths being a nuclear type kind of makes sense. It does seem like it could survive in these conditions. As well as this Pokemon, because it's a poison type. Some of these other Pokemon, I just don't understand. Like, it's part poison type, I can understand. Foolish child. It has been amusing watching you try, but here is where your story ends. How fortunate, the son of the man who has plagued our existence. 
and the child of the Rangers chief, and now both are within our grasp. We expect the Rangers will be more willing to obey when they hear we have the children hostage. Tell me, child, how does it feel to come so close, only to have your dreams crush it? Does it hurt? It should hurt. We want you to suffer, as we have suffered. Your friend. He is in status. Neither awake nor asleep, his thoughts trapped at the very moment he entered the capsule. What could he be feeling? Pain, fear, confusion, anguish? A single miserable moment drawn out into an eternity. That what is he feeling it is but a function, a fraction of what we felt. What he is feeling is only a fraction of what we felt. And now, you shall join him. Once we have the hostages, the rangers will have no choice but to surrender. Then nothing will stand in our way to an ultimate power. Oh? Even after all that, you still wish to bow us. How amusing. Very well, we accept your challenge. We hold the power of nuclear energy and disappear. Alright, Chick, you think you can. I mean, dude, do you think you can beat me? Okay, you're level 60, I'm level 50. I'm gonna switch out. Nothing, nothing, you ain't doing nothing. This music is popping, I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> You're a uh, fine and. a fine and nuclear type. I would like to switch into S51, but I'm gonna save him for later. Buxon could be able to outspeed you. Probably not, though. Girls, keep. can you? Nope. Damn, you're gonna hit me with a fine type attack, what am I do? I can switch the Lux Long on this situation, but... Or with Gyarados. Fine Gyarados, you have to intimidate. Oh my god. He mega evolved into this behemoth? Ah, uh, boy. Should I, should I, like, what should I do? I'm just gonna aqua tell. Damn! And we are dead. That's four times super effective, so. What? Oh, yeah, Bloodlust. This one has a crazy ability. I could just switch into Nucleon, right? No. Actually, no! I didn't mean to. Alright. Shadow Ball super effective. Hyper Voice is Stab. Hyper Voice is 10% base power plus Stab is an extra 0.5 boost. Um, whereas Shadow Ball is times 2. So it's doubled. So the base power of 1 at 80 base power move is 160. Hyper Voice is boosted by Stab, plus an extra 10%. A 1.5 boost will take it to 1.40. I mean, 140. Plus an extra 10%, that's like 150. Or 150 something. Shadow Ball is stronger. Okay. Oh, that's neutral. Oh, so you are part dark. And we gave it a bunch of health. Great. And Bloodlust. Great. <sighs> I'm just gonna switch to the S51 effort. You are faster than this, uh. 
<gasps> you are intimidated? Uh, no. I still did a lot. That is, what the, how are you gonna go for crunch, bro? You are part- wait, did I just prove it myself? Shadow Ball was neutral- yeah, what the hell am I doing? I'm such an idiot. Part dark and nuclear, okay. Who is it? There's nothing in the mailbox, I checked. Aha! I got real lucky right there. You are dead, no doubt. I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted from the noise in the background, so I wasn't able to focus. Let's try doing this. Oh, Luxlong is dodging. Not bad. Go for that if you want to, boy. I got something for your ass. One more. Gamma ray. Does that take you down to 50%? No, never mind. Yep, goodbye. That's gonna burn me, isn't it? Yep. Xeno Queen. Holy moly. That Pokemon looks savage. I'm not even gonna lie. That Pokemon actually looks dope. Probably my favorite nuclear Pokemon in this game. Intimidated and burned. Let me show you guys something uh, that will put you in complete disarray. Actually, no. I'm not going to do it yet. This one can burn me again. Potentially. Needs to then. Oh, you've overheat. Jeez, I'm dodging all of them. <laughs> I'm intimidated and burned. There's no way that's gonna kill. I am heat proof. I can actually heal. If I tried using a full restore right there, I would have just. It would have been in vain. But if he wants to overheat me, that's fine. You can go ahead. Does he have more Pokemon? I feel like he does. Oh my god, you're a physical attacker. Alright, Nikolon, you're up. Then kill. You glad I'm gonna have to put a life orb on you instead. Didn't your special attack get harshly dropped? Yes, it did.
I don't know why I risked that, but I did. What? No, 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 no! What? No! This can't be happening. We were supposed to be invincible. Uranus, how could you... Just a child, I don't understand. All we have striving for, all this power, gone. Uranus, answer me. Uranus. Looks like it went back to his dormant form. No, I failed us. I failed you to protect you. The rangers will come for us now. They will surely destroy you. I'm sorry. You're still alive, even though you lost most of your power. That's it. That's all we need. Oh, and then they just left before I could finish the sentence. Kellen, Pluto. Pluto, do you copy? Oh, thank Garcias. You're all right. Something was blocking the signal. I could get through it. I couldn't get through you at all. Pluto, I was so afraid. I thought we had lost you forever. So what happened? Did you find Archie? Did you find Kiri? I, mean, I meant. <laughs> I said Archie. I see. So you battled them. You won. But they managed to escape. Well, with Rain in a weaker form, they aren't as big as a threat anymore. Plus, it seems like the radiation that was coming out of the power plant has stopped it. Using our ranger's corpse. Using our ranger corpse? We could be able to locate it, the upper hand Curie easily. And it's all thanks to you, Pluto. Because of your c courage and determination, Tender will be saved. But... What about Thea? Is he, you know, alive? I want to ask the question so minor tone like that. The glasses broke. Look, what happened? Pluto? I love the detail right there, how he was just coming out of the glass and then he just woke up like that. Where's Kiri? The last thing I remember is them shoving me into a tank. Bill, you're alright? I'm right... I'm right as rain, chief. I'm right as rain? What? <laughs> Being in that thing, it was awful. I have no idea how long I was in there. Pluto, I don't know how to say this, but I'm pretty sure I owe you my life. So did you, you know, do it? Do you beat Curie? Wow, that's Pluto for you. Losing is not an option for you. Man, it, uh, it must have been an awesome bow. I can't believe I was right here, but I missed the entire thing. I'm glad you're alright, Theo. I'm saying the Rangers to pick you up and Pluto right now. Thanks, boss. I'm sorry I disobeyed your orders. I was stupid, and I put the whole mission in danger. I think after this, I'm going to take on a break from adventuring. I'm going to stay in the hospital with my dad. I'll be there when he wakes up. That's your choice to make. I'll see you both soon. This is Kellen signing off. I'm tired, Pluto. We should get out of here. Come on, I'll show, I'll show you the shortcut. He knows the shortcut. Huh? And so Pluto and Theo return to the Ranger headquarters. When they arrived, they were greeted as heroes. The word, the word spread throughout Tendor about Pluto's victory over Kiri. Yeah, I believe that's it. So we're going to end the episode because it's getting long. Thank you guys for watching. We'll be back. Until then, peace.